So the other day, I went out with my buddy Jim Cannon. He's uh, at 22LR Marksman on Instagram. He's a really competitive long range shooter. And he took us out to basically learn how to use my new Tika long range gun. Um, I've never really been long range shooting, so I just followed him and he took us out into the middle of absolutely nowhere. Now, we did film a proper video on this, but uh, we also wanted to film some behind the scenes, sort of a vlog style as well. So I brought along the little Osmo action cam, sort of like a GoPro, just to get some behind the scenes footage. So anyways, he took us out into the middle of absolutely nowhere, but it was gorgeous. Um, we set up two steel targets, one at a thousand yards, one at about 500 yards. And then we went around this huge dirt road to kind of the other side of a mountain. And uh, we set up right there. So first up, Jim kind of taught me how to actually mount my scope properly since like I said I don't really know what I'm doing once we got the scope mounted Jim wanted to get it sighted in at a hundred yards so I just walked up the side of a mountain we just like used a range finder to find a hundred yards set up a you know like a little paper target and we got the thing sighted in it took a minute uh, but we did finally get there and then Jim's goal was to have me hit the thousand yard target first shot so he did all his his crazy math equations, which we'll go over in the in the actual video. But uh, we got down there. Don't well, mind me. Over here hitting at a thousand yards. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> Took my first shot. Didn't hit. It, did, it didn't happen. Um, it was probably like five shots in that I actually hit, but I did hit at a thousand yards. Super big deal. I was stoked on it. Jim brought out some of his other guns and uh, we all got to shoot at a thousand yards. Kyle got a little cocky. Kyle wanted to step up there, try his luck at a thousand yards. Low left. Low left. You son of a bitch, I hit it. <laughs> okay, Kyle did hit it. I said that in the, in the action cam footage, he hit it. Uh, it just happened to be that when I filmed it, he didn't hit it. Listen, I'll, I'll vouch for him though. He, he did it last time. I was like, we need to redo it, get it on camera. And then he choked, so. Oh, good thing I edit this and I don't have to put that in there, huh? <laughs> no, no, no video, no proof kind of deal. And then Jim, Jim kind of stepped up and he's like, all right, that's cute guys, we'll watch this. So Jim actually has a viral video of him shooting at a thousand yards, a bolt gun, and he shoots two rounds before you even hit here, the first one hit the steel and you know, he hits both. So he double taps two rounds before you even hear the first impact. So he wanted to one up himself and triple tap it. So he has a new gun. He, he built this thing from the ground up. It was gorgeous. It was a semi-auto gun. And this time he, he tried to do a triple tap. So here's what went down. Oh, yeah, the fact that he baby. hit that was Woo. absolutely <laughs> mind-blowing. I'm over here running through an entire 10-round mag trying to hit one shot at a thousand rounds, and he comes up there and just triple taps. Absolutely nuts, but he was fantastic. Huge, huge shout out to him for taking us out. As I mentioned, I'm gonna have a proper video on this whole experience that kind of goes more over him and his shop and what he does and stuff like that. So be on the lookout for that. I just want to give you guys some behind the scenes into it, get it, get it hyped up a little bit. And uh, yeah, so really it was a blast. It was awesome to be able to hit at a thousand yards and uh, I'm excited for more long range shooting stuff. So if you are too, hit that like button, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought of the video. Uh, we like to, you know, throw in a little bit of these, these behind the scenes videos anytime we do a, a big shoot or anything. So for more behind the scenes stuff on Greenlight, make sure to check out Instagram, that is at GL Shooting. Grab yourself some Give Rise gear if you're in the market and uh, I'll see you next time on Greenlight Shooting.